My name is Rachel Vaughn and I am a sophomore at Concordia University in Irvine, California. But I've been a member of Trinity Lutheran Church ever since I was born in 1999. But my parents moved here 25 years ago when my dad got a call to be the youth DCE. As we've gotten older and stuff, we've still been connected and rooted here. I am Grace Yoder. I am 12 years old and I go to Trinity Lutheran School where I am in seventh grade. Um, my parents are Jay and Mary Yoder and they are very active in the church. And um, my brother is Jackson, he goes to UHI, and my sister is Shelby, they're both older. Um, yeah, we're very active with Trinity. Um, we've gone to Trinity Lutheran Church for about 11 years, so pretty much my whole life. Um, my sister started at Trinity Lutheran School in fifth grade, and we've just started going to this church ever since. What touches me most is all the teachers at the school and like the principal, they care so much about me and they're always smiling and always saying, hey Grace, how you doing? And that's, that's really important, along with, with the pastors and the DC and Christy at the church. And they're just, they're just so caring and you know, they're always asking about you and your faith and they, they just care a lot about you. And that, that's really important to me. I think what is most important to me coming back to church, but then also something that's been going on throughout my connection with Trinity has been the fellowship. Pastors have changed and DCEs have changed, but it's been really cool coming back to see families. You know, people's faces light up, my face lights up, and giving them a hug, and they ask how I've been, I ask how their year's been, and um, I think the fellowship, and that's been something that's stayed consistent. I'm really excited for the connection of the church and school. Um, while I've been at school, people have talked about how much of a blessing it is to have the church and school be one. And we've had that, but in two different facilities. And now it can actually happen. Having a presence of both the church and the school um, is what I'm really excited about because then it's not gonna be like a 10, 15 minute drive to go see each other. I'm just really excited about that. Yeah, that's really exciting because you hear people talk about, you know, back when the school was at the church here. And I remember just thinking that that must have been so cool. You know, you could you could see your pastors walking to science and you could you could worship at chapel in the same place that you do on Sundays. And with the church near like moving to the school, they'll actually be able to do that. And that's just so cool. I think it's really special that the, there's people in the older generations who are looking out for me and for you know my future kids or my friends' kids. Um, and so I'm really excited to have a multi-generational connection at the church, but it's really, really, I don't know, I think it's a blessing just having people looking out for us and how are we gonna grow the church. Um, it's not just a here and now, it's a multi-year, mindset. It really means a lot to me and it, and it gives me a lot of confidence in the church to know that they're building the church for me and my generation and our needs and, and the generation in front of me and behind me and it's just it's just really cool to know that, that they care about me and not just not just them and their generation and what they want. They're planning for me and that, that's just really cool. Thank you so much for spiritually and financially supporting the campaign and for all of your prayers. We appreciate it a lot and we're so excited. And thank you for your willingness to go through this change of what this new facility is going to look like. Um, it's just really exciting to see this church coming together in both ways and for your um, ability to think about this and um, pray about this and knowing that this is going to bless us and many others um, while all doing it for the glory of God. Thank you. Thank you.